today, through tonight, and indeed through much of tomorrow as well. We're going to see temperatures slowly dropping in the north, colder winds coming in from the Arctic. It's pretty chilly across Scotland today, only about 5 to 7 degrees there. That goes for Belfast as well. Whereas further south, we've still got temperatures in double figures. The very strong winds from this morning have now moved away into the southern North Sea. They're going away with that fella, and that's going away pretty smartly too. It is going to introduce this switch in the wind direction, though, later on today through tonight and tomorrow. You can see how it comes in from the north. A cold blast of air then coming southwards during Wednesday. Increasingly wintry showers heading south at the same time. That's how the wet weather was a short time ago. That band of rain still nudging across the Thames estuary, still affecting that southeastern corner of England, but it should be out of the way before too much longer. The rain should gradually peter out through the afternoon. Elsewhere, there are some showers coming through, some fairly beefy showers at that, and increasingly wintry ones too as you go north, up across northwest England into Northern Ireland and Scotland during the rest of daylight hours today. Then some more showery bursts of rain will approach the far southwest here, coming in across Wales and the west country this evening, then filtering across more southern counties of England tonight. Further north, I think we are going to see frequent snow showers gathering from the Arctic. Later on tonight into the morning, we could see quite a good covering of snow, extra snow across the far north of Scotland, mainly in the Highlands, of course, uh, once we get through to daylight hours tomorrow. Icy patches on untreated roads in the north. Further south, I think there could be a touch of ground frost, but these more southern counties hanging onto that cloud will stay a few degrees above freezing. Well, looking onto the continent, you can see the massive cloud coming across the UK. It's extending very rapidly southwards at the moment across France. It's just about dry in Marseille, but for the match this evening between Marseille and Chelsea, there could well be some showery rain to come there. Temperatures around about 11 degrees, bit of a greasy surface, I would think, for the match itself. And a very nasty area of low pressure developing in the next couple of days, pushing in through the Adriatic, through Greece, into Turkey. That's going to bring some pretty stormy weather there. Once again, the best of it with the high pressure down across Iberia and down into the Canaries, not too bad either, but certainly for the Costa del Sol de Algarve, some really super weather to come in the next few days. That's how Wednesday's looking then. Rather a showery picture, some wintry showers had ex extending south through the day onto the higher ground of southern England and Wales as well. But the more frequent snow showers, I think, are likely to remain across more northern parts of Scotland. Certainly a chilly wind blowing, strong to gale force north to northwesterly winds. Then things switch around again during Thursday. Wet and windy weather will spread in from the west. And then again, Arctic winds returning at the end of the week. And that's it from me just for now. Yes, it's been a sunny winter over England and Wales.